wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best USB DACs. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10, the British-built Meridian Director does a truly impressive job of upgrading the audio quality of your digital device for crystal clear playback. Its slim design features RCA output and SPDIF input to suit a wide range of systems. It comes in a durable and attractive housing. However, there's no headphone port and it's extremely expensive. At number 9, the new Force UDAC 3 features RCA and headphone outputs, so you can easily switch between playback over speakers and through your favorite set of earbuds depending on your needs. It also has a convenient rotary dial for quick volume adjustments. It features a capacitor-free signal path and is available in three colors, but it suffers with unbalanced left and right channels. Coming in at number 8 on our list. The Cybersonic SD-DAC 63057 is a great budget model that doesn't sacrifice sound quality for savings. It features an integrated D-pop function to suppress the popping sounds that come from your computer or other device as it starts up or shuts down. It offers a quick plug-and-play operation and digital and analog output options. However, the headphone output is a bit weak. To see all of our choices, go to wiki.easybit.com and search for USB DACs, or click beneath this video. At number 7, the Turtle Beach Audio Advantage Micro 2 is a pocket-sized option that you can always keep handy to improve your listening experience. It isolates the audio signal from the electronics of your device to provide a cleaner sound. It doesn't require additional power and includes an optical digital adapter, but it's over-amplified for headphones. Moving up our list to number 6. Ideal for home theatre systems, the hefty Cambridge Audio DAC Magic 100 is a real powerhouse, thanks to its four options for digital audio input. Switch easily between Toslink Optical, two coaxial ports, and a standard USB input with its front-facing source button. It features a Wolfson 24-bit converter and impressive output from any device. However, the input selector resets when it's shut off. Halfway up our list at number 5. The Topping Mark II is designed to stay put as it's larger and heavier than most other models, but it's packed with features others don't have, like a dedicated headphone amplifier and banana plug outputs for connecting a set of passive speakers. It comes with rubber feet for stability and an automatic shut-off for when your computer's asleep, but it does produce some audible buzz. At number 4, the Mika Origen Plus is a high-resolution pre-amplifier that offers studio-quality sound from most listening devices. It runs on a dedicated power supply for stability and has a wide range of input and output options to ensure compatibility with almost any setup. It can bypass a computer sound card and is a selectable game design. However, it's difficult to use with Windows 10. Nearing the top of our list at number 3, the FIO E10K has a simple and attractive volume control dial integrated on the front for quick and easy adjustments without the need to mess with computer or software commands. Its durable all-aluminum shell is designed to limit interference. It features analog and coaxial digital outputs, a built-in 3 decibel bass boosting circuit, and a strong and clean headphone output. To see all of our choices, go to wiki.easybit.com and search for USB DACs, or click beneath this video. At number 2, take Hi-Fi audio with you everywhere you go with the Apogee Groove. It has a constant current drive that helps to provide a smooth frequency response with any pair of headphones, and simple three-level volume controls built right in. It boasts four converters per channel and ultra-low distortion. It eliminates jitter and noise. And taking the top spot on our list, improve audio detail, transparency, richness, and tone with the Audio Quest Dragonfly Red. This pocket-sized model can connect directly to headphones, powered speakers, or an amplifier with impressive results, and is capable of output up to 2.1 volts. It features a 32-bit Sabre driver and an award-winning design. It's extremely simple but effective. To see all of our choices, go to wiki.easybit.com and search for USB DACs, or click beneath this video.